Yeah. It's a big hit with my dad. All yeah. he wants to do is hunt and fish. And he wanted to. That's the place to do that, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> the majority of people feel Zack Snyder's Justice League is only there to increase HBO Max subscriptions. Despite the fact that $70 million for a remake of a failed film may seem like a lot of money, Netflix and Disney have consistently spent more on original material. Indeed, if Warner Brothers had bought into Snyder's original vision, Joss Whedon would not have had to reshoot 95% of the movie after Snyder had gone. Amber says, Babe, you're not getting punched. I'm not sure what the motion of my hand was, but you're fine. I didn't hurt you. I didn't punch you. I was hitting you. God, I get so angry sometimes that I lose it. It also disproves the theory that the fans are solely responsible for its existence. Every side of it seems, um, it just seems to be continuously escalating on all the sides. Johnny Depp fans away are not really willing to listen to accusations. Snyder lobbied Warner Brothers to keep Amber Heard on board for Aquaman 2, according to source Daniel Rickman. During the Justice League reshoots, he had a blast working with her. We know how well they got along, and Heard has praised Snyder. But he no longer has a say in the franchise's fate, and hasn't in a long time. Gorgeous on the cover of uh, this magazine. Thank you. And I couldn't, uh, I couldn't help but uh, staring at your tats. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> One's, well, one's I love red, your accent. <laughs> the tattoos, I'm talking about the tattoos, yeah. of course. Oh, I, yeah, yeah, look, if you see it? Right. Yeah. On each DCEU film, he is listed as a producer. However, this is simply a courtesy title, similar to John Favreau's executive producer designation on the Avengers films. In addition, the filmmaker recently claimed that he and the studio never completely agreed on Justice's direction and that he was pressured to incorporate more comedic and lighter elements. When Justice League reaches theaters on March 18th, Warner Brothers has no plans to create a direct sequel, and Snyder's involvement in the film is likely to come to an end. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> How did you find a tattoo artist who tattoos uh, Farsi? It was difficult. <laughs> <laughs> what, what, where did you, like, did you just bring him? It, was, it was not the kind of tattoo you get after like a wild night out. It wasn't drinking. like te no. tequila, you weren't drunk so, at all. No, it's not a drunk. According to what I've heard, higher management is desperate to get rid of him as soon as feasible. He may want to see Heard reprise her part as Mira in Aquaman 2, but the choice will be made by the Warner Brothers boardroom or the court in her next legal battle. Depending on what happens between now and then, an internet petition requesting that studio personnel remove Amber from the forthcoming Aquaman film has gotten over 1.5 million signatures. Mads Mikkelsen has been announced to replace Johnny Depp in the forthcoming Fantastic Beast film, which was started by Gene Larson. The letter is addressed to both Warner Brothers and DC Entertainment. Well, the, uh, they're both poetry. The top one is this um, Pablo Neruda quote that I like. And the bottom one is from this um, 10th century poet philosopher named Omar Khayyam. He, um, it's in Farsi. Oh, yeah, of course. So I could tell you what it... <laughs> I, I could recite it for you, yeah, yeah, yeah. absolutely, yeah. So, in like Farsi. I said, like I said, yeah, I, I, it's really beautiful, it's poetry, but yeah. at least I think. So far, 1.5 million individuals have signed the petition, accounting for more than half of the 3 million signatures required. Larson outlines the petitioner's demand that Heard withdraw from the upcoming DC film in which she'll reprise her role as Mira, stating that it's about Depp and the actress's relationship in the description. Pud has been accused of lying as well as being a known and proven domestic abuser. Throughout the months-long trial, Larson, a great fan of the Pirates of the Caribbean actor, is attempting to convince petitioners to make allegations. Amber Heard's appearance in Aquaman 2 has sparked a lot of interest in recent months. Unconfirmed reports have surfaced online and social media claiming that the actress will not reprise her role as the warrior Mira in Warner Brothers sequel to James Wan's 2018 smash movie and that she will be replaced. On the other hand, Heard argues that such claims are untrue. I'm delighted with the amount of fan love and appreciation for Aquaman as well as the fact that it's created so much interest in Aquaman and Mira that will be back. I did. He's in L.A. right now um, doing some construction on my house. He's like a man's man, like a tough Texas guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. What did you that. do? Uh, what did you do for Father's Day? I um, I, I, it was really special. I'm a, I'm a, a pretty excellent daughter. I. Um, oh, it's very nice of you to say. Yeah, it just you got to know your strengths. Yeah, right? and what did you? Great so you did something tests. special for your dad. Yeah, I brought him to uh, the Magic Mike press convention. <laughs>
Yeah, and so he loved it. Justice Andrew Nicole decided on November 2nd that an allegation made in a son's story concerning Rupert Murdoch's relationship with Amber Heard that Depp was a husband beater was substantially factual. Domestic abuse affects men and women equally. This has to be recognized, and actions are taken to prevent unknown abuser from being recognized in the entertainment industry. Larson explains how eliminating the Amber sound in Aquaman 2 was the right decision. Patrick Wilson and Jason Momoa will reprise their roles in James Wan's forthcoming film in 2022. The studio, on the other hand, has yet to authorize Aquaman 2. Its cast has yet to be picked, and no start date has been determined, and because of the pandemic, production schedules are hazier than ever. It's no wonder that when Johnny Depp's libel action against the UK newspaper heated up, rumors about Heard increased. Depp has launched a lawsuit against the Sun newspaper, saying that during their brief 2015 marriage, he was abusive to Heard. An audio recording of Heard admitting to hitting Johnny Depp was played during the January trial. If you liked the video, please make sure to appreciate our content by hitting the like button. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and tap the bell icon to get notified of the other videos that we release.